So we are the Royal Victoria Hotel at Lamberis. Um, we've got 106 bedrooms, we have about 40 weddings a year, restaurants, bars. We have about, around about 45,000 sleepers every year and it's predominantly a tourist hotel. Previously the hotel was basically focused on tour groups, so coach parties booked almost a year out. So as this last kind of five or six years has changed our economy, people want to book with much shorter lead time so they're going to book on the internet and they're going to book it within a kind of couple of weeks of coming here so that meant that our whole way of taking business changed quite dramatically over that time and that was another necessity that we needed a better broadband system. Royal Victoria here it's a little bit unusual with them being on the edge of the network fibre to the cabinet is still not available, so they've invested in fibre to the premises, which is a dedicated fibre lease line, which delivers them a far superior service than you would be able to have at home even. Previously, the standard broadband speed, all that was available here was about one to two megabytes. With the dedicated lease line that they've invested in, it's currently uh, 30 meg down and 30 meg up, so it's synchronous and it's uncontended with anybody. Well, I'll just have to think well to go handy at the first super fast broadband one, have a booking standing call um, at reception, um, and the draw at the gate at lots of people match, but she's done in case she tells you about quite lots of quests, just not in backlog, don't be it, and I'm going to tell you when I'm on lot house, and the one my lot of quests are my pub, but in case she promotes your business on Facebook, at the hot Twitter about them and pub, or the bar, the bar. The move was made because of customers' requirement to use Wi-Fi, but having gone through the exercise, it was less expensive than we thought it would be for a massive gain in terms of our business, so we feel it was well worthwhile. Mm -hmm.